Well, hundreds of city workers walking off the job. It has been two days since about 600 Portland City employees began a strike demanding better pay. Fox 12's Adrian Thomas takes a look at what the impact has been so far and joins us live from where some of those workers are picketing. Adrian. Hey, Riel, good evening. Yeah, we are here along North Kirby Avenue, just across the street from uh, some of the city's uh, transportation bureau, faci bureau facilities. You can see there are some workers out here picketing right now. The workers striking across the city include those who treat and maintain roads, sewage treatment and management, and those who work in the city's parks department, all represented by Local 483. We took a look at some of the areas of the city that could be impacted by the strike, like city parks, and so far, things seem to be holding up. We ventured out to multiple Portland parks today, including Washington Park and Peninsula Park. There wasn't a lot of buildup of trash or anything needing to be repaired. One Portlander sharing some concerns if the park's crews aren't around to keep them nice. It would make me really sad. It's a beautiful park, especially the Rose Gardens on the other side. Always smells amazing in the summer. And if it got dirty or not as safe and they're not around as much, it wouldn't be as... It's fun to come here. Yeah. The city says because of the strike, trash collection in the parks could be delayed, as well as general maintenance of any facilities. Mayor Ted Wheeler has the authority to bring in temporary workers to fill in the gaps if needed. A union spokesperson shared their top concerns at the strike this morning. We want wages that respect our efforts, that recognize our ability to live in the city we serve, and we want safe working conditions. The local 483 union is asking for a 3.5% annual raise for all workers for the first two years of this next contract, which the union has not had with the city since June 2022. One worker for the city's transportation bureau also says the city needs to do more to protect its workers from the public safety crisis on the streets. Cleaning sewers is one thing, but having another human being who may have mental illness spit on me, I wasn't, that wasn't part of my job. Now, the city has reportedly offered a 1% annual across the, board, across the board raises. The local 483 union says there is another mediation session scheduled with the city tomorrow. Live in North Portland, Adrian Thomas, Fox 12 Oregon.